In this video, I will consider an example to implement Boolean function using 8 is to 1 marks. Realize the following Boolean function using 8 is to 1 marks with W, Y, Z as select lines and here the function f of w x y z is given and these are the values where output output is 1. So we supposed to implement this function with the help of 8 is to 1 max. We know that in 8 is to 1 max we need 3 select lines. We need 3 select lines. So here it is said that we supposed to use w y z as a select lines. We supposed to use w y z as a select line and the function is having four variables that is w x y z so here by default w is msb and z is lsb so to understand this first let me write the truth table for this four variables that is w x y z though this truth table is not required if we write this truth table it will be very easy to understand that's why i am writing the truth table here so that one can easily understand how to implement any boolean function using 8 is to 1 max. So here we have 4 variables. Let me write all possible input values. So we have 0 to 15 possible values that is 0. For 0 we will write it in binary as 0, 0, 0, 0. 1 can be represented as 0, 0, 0, 1, 2, 0, 0, 1, 0 and 3, 0, 0, 1, 1, 4, 0, 1, 0, 0, 5, 0, 1, 0, 1, 6, 0, 1, 1, 0, 7, 0, 1, 1, 1, 8, 1, 0, 0, 0, 9, 1, 0, 0, 1, 10, 1, 0, 1 0 11 1 0 1 1 12 1 1 0 0 13 1 1 0 1 14 1 1 1 0 and we have 15 that is 1 1 1 1 so here it is said that for these values we supposed to write output as 1 so these are the cell numbers where we supposed to write output as 1 that is the mean terms that is 0, 1, 2. So for 0 output is 1, for 1 output is 1, 2 output is 1. Then we have 5, 7, 8. That is 5, 7, 8. Then we have 9, 12, 13. 9, 12, 13. In all other cases output is 0. So this is the function and this function we supposed to implement using 8 is to 1 max. So this is 8 is to 1 max. So here we supposed to consider W, Y, Z as select lines. So let me use the variable W, Y, Z as select lines. These are select lines and these are data lines. So we have 8 inputs. I will represent data line variables as d0, d1, d2, d3, d4, d5, d6 and d7 and this is the output. So we have 8 inputs and 3 select lines. We are using wyz variable as a select lines. Table like this. So here along the column we have to represent the data input values that is d0 d1 that this is d2 d3 d4 d5 d6 and d7 so here we have the variables w x y y z so here w y z can be used for the select lines the remaining variable is x so here we can observe that the value of x either it is 0 or 1 so first row i will use for x as a 0 so i will take complement of x that is x bar and another row I will use x as a 1. So if x is 1 we will use this row. If x is 0 we will use this row. So with one variable we have two possible cases. One is 0, one is 1. So now look at this x column. So for the value 
zero for the cell number zero one two three the value of x is zero that is here it is zero for cell number zero one two three so for cell number zero one two three the value of x is zero so here value of x is zero means the complement of x that is x bar so let me represent zero one two three in first row that is zero one two three so next here we can observe for four five six seven four five six seven the value of x is one so these four five six seven cell numbers we supposed to give in second row because its value is one if value is one then we have to use direct variable if value is zero we have to take complement so we supposed to write four five six seven in second row again here we can observe that for eight 9 10 11 its value is 0 so these cell numbers we have to write in again first row because 0 means complement of x the complement of x is first row here we have to write 8 9 10 11 similarly 12 13 14 15 are x those we have to write in second row that is 12 13 14 and 15 so after writing this now for cell number 0 value is 1 so for cell number 0 we have to put one circle like this for cell number 1 value is 1 put circle like this for cell number 2 value is 1 put circle like this so wherever 1 is there for that we have to put the circle so here for 5 cell number 5 1 is there so put the circle then for 7 put the circle 8 9 we have 8 9 then we have 12 13 we have 12 13 those are nothing but these numbers for all these numbers we have to put the circle that is 0 1 2 5 7 0 and we have 8 9 12 13 8 9 12 13 so remaining cell numbers are nothing but zeros so after writing after putting circle on the cell numbers the next step is now concentrate on the first row first column here it is d not so here circle is made for zero so the value of d not will be equal to x bar so now for d1 there is a circle for both the cases in that case we have to write it as d1 is equal to x plus x bar x plus x bar as we know x plus x bar is nothing but 1 similarly d2 d2 will be is equal to circle is for first row its corresponding variable is x bar we have to write x bar then for d3 that is d3 is equal to the circle is for second row second row is with respect to variable x this is x like this so d4 here also we have x plus x bar that is nothing but 1 so d4 is also 1 then d5 is our circle is for both the cases that we have to take it as x plus x bar its value is 1 so for d6 there is no circle for both the cases its value is 0 d7 there is no circle so its value is 0 so thus we have found the input given to the these input variables so now according to these values we have to do the connection in 8 is to 1 max so now we can see here d not will be equal to x bar d2 will be equal to x bar so let me consider d not and d2 the value is x bar so here let me take the input as x the output of this is connected uh, it is connected to inverter output of this is x bar so as we seen here d not and d d not and d2 should be connected to x bar so let me short d not and d2 this d not and d2 are shorted and this x bar is connected to this one so x bar is, d not will be equal to x bar d2 is equal to x bar so now similarly let me take d1 so here d1 value is 1 d4 value is 
एंड डी फाइव वैल्यू इज वन सो कनेक्ट डी वन डी फोर डी फाइव टू वन वन मीन्स लॉजिक हाई डी वन डी फोर डी फाइव दैट इज वी हैव डी वन डी फोर डी फाइव दीज टू आर शॉर्टेड एंड अलॉन्ग विथ वन इज शॉर्टेड एंड ऑल दीज आर कनेक्टेड टू लॉजिक हाई दैट इज लॉजिक वन मीन्स फाइव ओल्ट so these all are, all three are shorted so similarly now here we can observe that d3 value is x so here d3 value is x so here we have d3 so d3 will be connected to x so take x here the, this x is connected to d3 so here d6 and d7 are zero Zero means we have to connect D six and D seven is shorted and connected to ground. That is nothing but logic zero. So this is the output. That is B. So this is the implementation of given Boolean function using eight is to one marks, where we have used W Y Z as select lines and X another variable X is used and which are connected to corresponding inputs. Thank you for watching.